Alright, what's up guys? So, as you already know, my name is James, or you may better know me as The Palm. So, today's all base review is brought to us by Mr. Pomade of Pomade.com. And so, today we'll be taking a look at Bird Hair Pomade. So, this pomade right here is made in California, and as you already know, I have a really big spot in my heart for pomades that are made in California. And also, the reason why I wanted to show you guys this is because as you already know, or you may have noticed from the other pomades I review, I typically like to stay away from pomades that are commonly found or are aimed towards a rockabilly market. But at the same time, I stay away from like those products that are meant for like salon use. So I wanted to show you guys bird hair pomade. I've been using it for the past few days, and I actually am really impressed with it. So let's go ahead and get started, and we'll go ahead and look at the jar. All right, guys. So here's the pomade itself. As you can see. It's beautifully designed. I mean, I love it aesthetically. So we have beautiful branding on the front and also a nice, clean, like high contrast design along the sides, along with ingredients and directions and a small little caution for your pillowcase on the back. So it comes with a twist top and once we open it, you'll notice that it has like a nice white clearish color and you'll see in my finger marks that it's actually a pretty smooth product. Also you'll notice that it comes in a pretty small thin can. So this is a one ounce jar and this is the only size they sell. But it actually turns out to be pretty convenient and I'm actually really surprised at how much product I actually need to style my pompadour. So I'll talk to you guys about like how much I use and kind of you'll see that and kind of how easy it is to scoop out and apply later on. Alright, so that's the pomade itself. Upon opening, honestly, this is one of my most like favorite smelling and pomades. To me, it smells like straight up fresh laundry. Like sometimes I like the, the crazy sweet smell or like the crazy spice smell or just something like eccentric. But like a lot of other times, something I enjoy more than anything else is just fresh fresh laundry. And it just smells super clean. And so, go ahead and starting to scoop it out. We'll notice right away that like it's actually a pretty smooth pomade. Like it's really easy to scoop out and it's e really easy to like smear in your hands. And so as you already know, or you can actually kind of tell, I already have two days worth of buildup. And so I only have to add a little bit more. We'll go ahead and go for one more lick. And really make sure that I get the pomade underneath my hair at the nearby the roots where the support of my pompadour will be needed. So it's really easy to apply. My hands are running through my hair pretty smoothly. There's definitely like a good amount of wax in the product. However, it does it is it doesn't like affect my ability to apply my pomade or scoop it out of the jar in a bad manner. So go ahead and slick back my hair right now. Now we'll go ahead and form our part now. And again, like before, really take into account and take a look at how my comb is like moving through my hair and how smooth it's moving. Because I mean, if you notice, it's really easy to comb through right now. And you can kind of tell the product has a good amount of hold with it. So we'll go ahead and form my pump now. 
All right, I think I'm about done now, so let's go ahead and get a final inspection. As you can see, my sides are held on pretty nice and tight. The part is made sharp and hard, and the pompadour itself is at a nice like, round shape and at a good height. And you also notice, there's like a good sheen everywhere. So, in conclusion, I actually really, really like this product. So, the scent is basically on par with um, the Damon Barber. Those, this um, bird pomade and the Damon Barber are my favorite smelling pomades. Very light, floral, very fresh scents. Um, in terms of hold, I compare it to Grandad's Old Fashioned, like a very medium weight type of hold. And in terms of ease of application, it's like a light a bait, a weight pomade. It applies as easy as, say, like um, Lockhart's um, Goon Grease or almost almost to the extent of like a, a water-based product. Um, so overall, I actually really like this stuff. If you guys get a chance to try them out, you should definitely take up the opportunity. So I want to quickly thank you, um, Mr. Pomade of Pomade.com for sponsoring this um, review. And hope you guys would take a look at Bird Pomade and enjoy guys.